Hello and welcome to our complete series. Well, Ben here has been over to the island and he's been having fun. One with giggers. Ser seriously, you could have timed that better, dude. But, yep, yeah, he's got quite a lot of levels. I'm quite pleased with that. I mean, I've been. I put a bit of the actual uh, levels that he got into health. I stopped at about here because it was just taking too many. So I get gigas, uh, giga eggs. I mean, even with my settings, I can breed a lot of gigas like really, really quickly, way, way faster than you would on an official server. But I was starting to run out, so it's like okay, I think I better stop at that point. But yeah, I, I put I put a bit into into his health and a bit extra into stamina because I noticed when you want to like use them for torpor, the the stamina goes down like really quickly. I must admit, now uh, the rest really went into melee, so. Ben's done, whereas Bill, I've got him just sitting, still in a cryopod. So you can suggest that, so like the differences, I mean, Ben there's it's just over 4,000 health, and, and Melee, you might find that's about 431 on this one, versus over 700 on that, that one I leveled. But the only trouble is, it's the saddle. I mean, I went round all of the maps that I've done within these DLCs, that's the best I can get, and I, I don't think that's going to cut it. I mean, you're, you're going to be up against level 150 uh, dinos, and yeah, I mean, they do like a lot of bleed damage, to say the least. Uh, so I'm, I'm not overly comfortable of using that. I mean, you, you can actually get out of a, a mission. What I found is that you can go and do a mission, and then if you just exit the game, it will kick you out of the mission. So there is a way out if things like really go bad. <laughs> I must admit, so it's like a, a good try, you bird. I need a better saddle. I think that's I think that's the, the long and short of it. So until I get a better saddle, I'm, I mean, it's, it's taken quite a while just to level him up. So I think, although I've got Bill there as a backup, I think I'm going to wait until I find a decent saddle. It, it might be possible to find one on here. You, you can get Equus saddles, as far as I recall, in the swamp cave. The only trouble is you get those from the yellow loot crates and most of the crates in there tend to be uh, red so it could be a bit of a struggle I must admit. I mean I've heard of other people getting them from the loot drops but I haven't seen any in like the, the loot table for these orbital supply drops but yeah so I'm in a bit, bit of a pickle because I still need to do bulldog fetch and I still need to do maywing porch. So I think I'm gonna I have to start thinking about other things until I get that saddle. So, I've tried things like Star Dolphin and Star Wing Strike, and I just I can't get quite get the grips with that. It, it like it, seriously, dude, your timing's getting worse. The yeah, uh, I think it's just the controls. I just can't quite get it with those controls. So, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go and try and tame our own space dolphin. See if I can get uh, get a better handle on this because it's it's just it goes into a different mode and yeah that, that's like seriously confused me so I've got a lot of element so what we're going to do is we're going to head over to the other base over here and then we'll have a look around there and see what we can find oh now I didn't realize you oh interesting I didn't realize those were rare uh, on this mission, uh, on this map. I mean, they're on Genesis 1. I didn't realise you could get those on, on this one. Hmm. You learn new things every day. Right. So let's have a look. Oh, there's some over there. Ah, cool. That was easy enough. Uh, what time is it? Got plenty of time, I think. I'm not, I mean, my, my server settings are cranked up a bit. So, like, taming for me goes a lot quicker. Don't need as many resources either. But I really just I just want to sort of like test out and see what what the controls like more than anything. So that's a level twenty there. It's a level fifteen there. Now the thing is, I think they can get quite hostile. That's the only catch. <laughs> so Let's have a look and see. I mean, there's only these are just little, lower level ones. Um, hello. Oh, 
That one, that one seemed cheerful enough. Oh, I'm gonna have to be careful. I don't wanna, I don't wanna be running thing. Oh no! Oh no 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 no! What level's that thing? It's a level ninety void worm. Oh, don't. Um, forget about that. I'm, I'm get, I'm out of here. Ow, ow, ow! I'm getting electrocuted. This is not good. That's highly inconsiderate. <laughs> I don't want to get electrocuted by a void worm. I'm assuming that was the, the space wheel behind me, otherwise that could be problems. I don't know if those things hunt you down or not. Doesn't seem to, it doesn't seem to have followed me. Right, let's get out here. Right, what level are you then? Because I'm not going back there. You're a level 55. Right. We'll try this one then. And ho hopefully that void worm won't come back. Um, that wasn't particularly friendly. Um, do, do you mind? I'm, I'm like, ow. There you go. Come here, come here, come here. Come here, come, will you stay still? Right, so you're going to fly away now, are you? I better go up, grab something to eat. Oh, can you eat in space? No, you can't. That's not good. It's not good if you, ca if you can't eat in space. Right, you're over there now, are you? Oh! Can I, can I just pet you? Ow, 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 ow! Ow! It's just a case of really just spamming the E key. <laughs> Assuming you've still got it set to those settings, like. Right, where have you gone? Yeah, man. Well, oh, you've flown into the rock now, have you? Or are you just like stuck? Are oh, you going to run off again? Are you? I don't know. Yeah, you've got to. As far as I can tell, you've got to pet it twice and then you've got to try and feed it as much as you can in the sh shortest time that you've got and then you've got to start chasing it all the way oh, oh what's a oh, few i was thinking there was like a one of those void no 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 don't don't bite Dude. stay still person one of those creatures swimming in the interstellar medium and named it astro delphis Space Dolphin. Someone aboard figured out how to tame and ride them. Guess they must have had a lot of time on their hands. Okay, that, that's good to know. I'm I'm more concerned about these um these things called void worms. To be honest. Right, you stay still. <laughs> I need a saddle. I realise I don't have a saddle. Ah, oh, foobar. Right. Can we... And I don't have a cryopod. Right. Um, you're gonna you're gonna have to follow me then. Come on then. And we're gonna have to hope and pray that that void worm's not around. I keep forgetting. In the first, it seems the first time you tame something, you end up getting like an XP boost, which is interesting. Uh. You're kidding me. Because we're in space, I can't I can't take health potions and I can't eat anything either. Oh, I can't do that otherwise a little space dolphin here might get a bit lost. Yeah man. We'll have to go about this the slow way. And I just thought they um I think Lola's over at the 
the other base. Because I was going to try try her against one of those void worms, but now I just want to try and get familiar with the controls. Because that's what I'm struggling at with those with those two missions, the Star Wing, I think it is. Which one's whether the Star Wing? Yeah, Star Dolphin and Star Wing Strike. Because it's that reticule. They've got, they've got a so like an attack mode. And the, oh no no no! Oh, that's that's not good. Um, I think we want to head in this direction. Oh, it's going to attack my. <laughs> oh, jeez, Louise. I can see me going to have to get Lola. I mean, technically it's out of render distance, but... Right, I'll bring... I'll bring this one over to here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to head back here quickly <laughs> because I want to see what I can get out of this mess. Oh, jeez Louise. Right, so I need, I need some cryopods. What's I thought? Where did my cryopods end up? Or did I use them all up? Oh, food bar, my cryopods are all used up. Yeah, that's why, because I, I used them. I'll tell you what. I'll use that because then I can put that one into a cryopod. Right, where's Lola? There's Lola over there. So I'm curious because she's a lightning wyvern or wyvern. I'm curious what she'll do against like one of these void weapons. Jeez Louise. I'm going everywhere but where I want to go. Right, I think I want to be heading in that direction. Because my theory is that because she's a... She should have like immunity to the lightning strikes. I don't know if it'll affect me because I've noticed... If I, if I fly this and go up against, say, like a Shadow Man, I still get electrocuted and I still get knocked off. But I don't know what what she's going to be like against the uh, the Void Worm in comparison. I mean, I can always at least drag it away. It's just the trouble is with the timers. I mean, I, I could have gotten there quicker. Well, yeah, I suppose we could have teleported there. But yeah, that's trouble with I me. Mean, I can't really put her into a timer. By the time I put her into a timer, I'll have to wait longer to get um, to get her back out again. But that's it's interesting that that's the first void worm I've seen on this map. I mean, I did a dino wipe because the event's on. That's the first uh, void worm I've seen. Ooh, it's got bats ears. That looks exciting. Right, well, fingers crossed. I mean, it started attacking the base, then it started attacking the strider. I mean, that's a thought I should really put turrets up, really, now that I think about it. Right, well, I left our little dolphin over on the right. So that should still be there. Oh, there you are. Right, can I put you into a cryopod? No, 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 don't, don't go wandering off. I want to put you into a cryopod.
Right. Yeah, so this is this is something I've been puzzling over ever since I started this. You know, I was planning to do this map was what's one of these things gonna do? Oh sh truth, it's it's actually in the base. Oh no 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 It's actually in the base. Oh no, that's bad. How, how did you get in the base? Because it spawned in the base. Oh, Boobar, I wasn't thinking. Yeah, that's a, that's a bit of a dilemma, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, it's, it's literally spawned inside of my base. It's going to eat my year. Uh, now I'm glitching out of the base. I need it. I need it outside of the base. Can you land on the base? So I can't. I can't. <laughs> oh dear me! I can't attack it from. Like, can I hit it from up here? No. So even though it's... Tell you what. Can I shoot it? Oh yes, I can. Trouble is, it's eating my gatches. Yeah, it's going to keep eating the, attacking the gatches. I suppose I could get low at the... Yeah, I could get low at the keep there. Uh, on it. Jeez Louise. Um Hey, Survivor. Yeah. So that's interesting that so Lola couldn't sort of like attack it while it was inside of the base. So we were like biting trying to bite through the base. Ooh. Some interesting things we got there. To go and see how everybody's doing because I think it was attacking the um the gatches. So your health's alright. Oh wow. You took quite a beating there. Jeez Louise. You took a bit of a bash as well. So yeah so it obviously it was attacking outside and it must have glitched through when I came came back. You're alright. As are you. You're alright. I mean all of these all of these mantis are still going, the owls are still going. I mean, I, I deliberately have it set up so that they're all on passive. And there should be four of you owls. Ozzy's over at the other side, so, okay. But yeah, that was, that was, uh, <laughs> that was a bit close for comfort. Uh, so I never really got to test, test her out as such, but... That was always my theory was um she should have immunity to, to lightning strikes, but I'm not gonna try that again. Unless one happens to pop up. Right, so get rid of this because I don't need it. So basically I just I all I did is I just went out there with the um with a harpoon gun and some net projectiles because the idea is that if there was like a group of those the yeah, astrodelphus and you want to keep them separate you just you know you only want to tame one at a time you want to net the other ones you don't want to like spook them because they'll all get hostile then but can i actually make an astrodelphus saddle in yeah there we go oh we need 252 element 252 polymer 
Right, well, I'll s I may as well just dump that in there then. So that needed 252 polymer. Well, I know one easy way to get some polymer. Although I'll have to try not to get stuck on these things. Is that, that's the one dilemma. Oh, actually, I'm speaking of dilemmas. What states this in? Because text writing was getting attacked. Yeah, yeah, health's all right. I mean, I think they've got a lot of health anyway. Yeah, it's got a lot of health anyway. Right. We'll get Molly here to get us some more polymer. I'll just try and get out of the way before these things suddenly hatch and get me stuck so can you actually make some polymer while we're at it ah no we don't make the polymer here duh we'll make polymer in here yeah we can make some polymer there pretty quick to make come on Oh, they've all run away. Come back, come back. Right, so how much did... Oh, you're, you're overloaded, are you? Okay, right, well, in that case, pop that into storage. What else have you got? Uh, what can do with the spoiled meat, actually? and see how much food we've got in here for everybody oh we've got plenty of meat in here so how much polymer did we get there then 401 okay so <laughs> that wasn't difficult then right so an astrodelphus saddle so what's that one it's an astro sickness one so that's the big space wheel. So this is just the little, little dolphin. Right, so I'll pop him back out of the cryopod then. There you go. I think I'm going to call him Bert. Oh no, no. We'll call him Derek. Derek the dolphin. Um, can you like stay still? Yes, <laughs> stay still. Right, so I'll put the saddle on because it'll be easier. I think that'll be easier. Oh, I can't because I've got to uh, change name. So this is Derek the Dolphin. Why not? Ah, right. So you need element as well, don't you? So you can use grenades, but you also need element. I'll just leave the levels alone for now. All right, so left. That's it. So this is the problem I've been having is that when I do the missions, you essentially like you've got that reticule, which is like for aiming for your weapons. And typically where you're pointing to, this thing will go too. But it's like with 90 degree turns. I was finding it like really difficult. It doesn't seem, I don't know, it's not quite the same with this. Because normally it would just be like, he's just floating around. I mean, obviously he's slow because he's, um, he's not in space. So if you put him into Starwing mode, I mean, I'm just pointing his nose, basically. I'm just using a mouse and... I don't know, this seems easier than the, the mission. When I was doing the mission... I mean, the... Uh, I couldn't quite control it, like, as easily as I can. So it's, this is not really helping the most of it. It's like, ah, oh, grrr. So you can 
So they hold the shift key down and you can go faster, but it's that reticule. For some reason in the mission, that reticule seems to be a lot more important because you, you follow that. So you've got the, the larger circle is where it will, you know, eventually it lines up with the, the door. But I don't know. I was kind of like hoping that by getting this, I get a better handle and a better control over the actual uh, the Astrodelphus in the mission. So it does, doesn't quite feel the same. I'm just going to have to spend more time practicing. So, so left is to fire. Shift will go as the boost. And that's using it quite a bit. Okay, that was interesting. Hmm. So control takes them back out. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna have to seriously have to play around more on this thing to, to try and try and get more familiar with the controls, but even still it doesn't quite feel the same because that one what I found with that one is you you're constantly going forward. This is this is relatively slow, whereas like with in, in the in the mission it goes a lot faster. Right, where are where are we at then? So we are Right, so the base is over there. I'll go and park him over here. Yeah, I'll take him out of out of Star Wing mode. Hmm. It does take a bit of getting used to, but. <laughs> Oh, jeez Louise, the things you do. Right, so, out of curiosity, you've got seven levels so far. Hmm, well, I thought you'd have got more by now. We put... Okay, so you're excited. Yes, yeah, so I'm not getting that many levels. So it took, it, it took a heck of a lot of leveling to get this thing done. Um. Hmm. Tell you what. Let's go and put the furry thing back down. You can grab up some of these things because I don't need them at the minute. I'll go and get something to drink because I want to try that mission again because it's, it's driving me nuts. It's mostly, I think, the time at the moment. It's either banging into things or it's the time. It's taking too much time. Or at least I'm taking too long, I must admit. Because if you compare, if you compare these to like the when the first came out, they've, they've deliberately changed things. They've changed things within the missions, for like Maywing Porch and Bulldog Fetch as well. Uh, okay, the other one's over there. Oh yes, turkeys. Right, let's try this then. So this one is Star Dolphin. Should be able to plug you back into the simulation from here. Ready? Here nope. we go. Not even close. <laughs> So I was kind of like getting the hang of it, but it's just that it then got down at the time. The so system is a high-value target, and Rockwell's got it well defended. Okay. So is this called Poppy or something? So you can go into first-person mode, I've noticed, but if you do that, as soon as it starts, it takes you back out again. So, and the only way I've been able to get anywhere is by pointing that reticule. And that's, it's driving me bongers. 
Oh. Oh, actually, now that I realize, hold on, this is the wrong, is this the right one? <laughs> I'm getting confused. Is it? Ah. I'm not sure I approve of whatever you're doing. He's on to you by now, so he's he? probably left someone <gasps> ah. here to guard his prize. Okay. Power up. Nice. Ah. Power up. Nice. Yes, yeah, it's a different. It's a different one to the one I thought it was. Okay, so it's the other one I'm trying to do. So I have picked the wrong one. So I've no idea what I'll do. How I'll do on this one. <laughs> this. All oh, right. Okay. Yeah, this is a completely different one. The one I was planning on hold doing. On, hold on. Trying to open the firewall. What? I'm trying. Yeah, that didn't exactly go to plan, it's the wrong one. <laughs> so it's the other one, it must be Star Wings. Is it Star Wings Strike then? Should be able to plug you back into the simulation from here. Okay, well. Here we oh. go. Hopefully it's the right one this time. Oh man. Dillows. Makes some sense to visualize rerouting navigational control as an obstacle course. Okay. I'm a little less sure about the space dolphin part, but hey, why not? Yes, the problem I have with this one is more to do with with time, I think. Because one of the, one of the issues, one of the issues is literally just done something. You've done something to alter the uh, oh, the damage you take. But it's trying to get this. Um, yeah, yeah. It's trying to get trying to get familiar with the controls more than anything. I think that's my biggest problem. Oh, oh. So even though it's on, even though this is the easy level, this is supposed to be the easy level, and it's like, it's driving me nuts. Just because of the, like, the controls. Ow, 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 ow. Lost that door, survivor. Um, oh, we're going that way, are we? Yeah, and as soon as I, as soon as I sort of like get hit by something, jeez, Louise! As soon as I get hit by something, the problem then, then is ah, like ah. No, it's not. It's a dumb idea. I like lose lose the plot because it's. You've got to follow the reticule as far as I can tell. Oh! Go that way. Oh! Go that way. Go, that go, way. Go. Try a barrel roll. That's a neat trick. I've got I've got bigger problems than barrel rolls. Oh no! Which way are we going? Lost I don't know where. Door, Careful, that's a tight squeeze. I know. I must got stuck up in something there. Yeah, this is nothing like the that that Astro Delphus that I've just tamed. Ow! 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 Jeez Louise. So, if we don't run out of health, we'll run out of time. And I can't accelerate, I've noticed. At least it doesn't seem to want to. Yo! You know, you're a pretty good pilot. Oh! No! 
see that's a problem. Fail to reach the fail to reach the goal within the time limit. See, yeah, that's a big problem though because I've still got a lot of missions, but that's that's basically the bottleneck now for for my playthrough with Ark because I still need to do these ones, so these more solo ones. But these are like uh, I don't know, like arcade style games, which aren't really interesting to me. So there's a few of them I'll, I should probably be able to do because I've been able, I've gone back and I've gotten myself some some better um, armor which I can try out with those are the missions but I think the biggest problem is going to be trying to get through those missions because those specific ones where we've got to do the taming and we've got to do like playing around with that uh, Astrodelphus that's going to be the hardest part for me I think and unfortunately you, you just I mean the, the Ark is really designed to be a multiplayer game and it's geared up so that I think there's supposed to be like five people or something. And unfortunately what they've done is that you've got to do those missions to be able to finish the game and take on Rockwell. So yeah, so I could be a bit of a, a showstopper then if I can't sort those out. But there are still other things to do and that's all for another episode.